So, property market population driven is growing. Digital is growing. Uh, so more and more people are now online. The consumers are online. So guess what? The advertisers are now also moving online. For the last 30 years, TV globally has been the main uh, source of advertising. So TV gets the most of the advertising dollars globally. Last year, major milestone, that changed. Online overtook TV for the first time. It overtook print, uh, so newspapers and magazines, about five or six years ago. And now it's also overtaken uh, internet as well. Um, the good news uh, for the people who are in the advertising industry is that in Asia Pacific, the whole of the advertising market is growing. But on top of that, the fastest growing is online advertising, 15% uh, growth in online advertising. So what does that mean for big media companies? There is a major change taking place, if you don't already know it. If you look at the whole of Southeast Asia, what's happening to the media landscape? Traditional media companies, the print companies, the TV companies, the magazine companies, they are all declining, all reducing. Thailand, Malaysia, Indonesia, Singapore. Singapore announced, Singapore has a, what, a very large media company called Singapore. Okay, so um, Singapore Press Holdings, which is the largest media company in Singapore, for example, last week announced a drop in net profits, 42.5% drop. For the last five years, its revenue has been declining. It's been declining because it's moving online. And the same is happening here in Vietnam. If you look at newspapers, if you look at magazines, if you look at radio, uh, all are showing decline because it's moving online. So big changes taking place in terms of the media landscape.